using your Jandy heater, take two. Walk off to the equipment. Make sure your filter pump timer is on. There she is. Nice new Jandy heater. Boom, calm. You get to this setting, you have pool, spa. That just means that it allows you to have two different temperatures set. This won't change the valves for you. You still have to do your normal valve change if you want to just use the hot tub or if you want to be in pool mode. So we're going to pool. Pool heat, you can see it's set at 80 degrees. The blower turns on. Then we wait. You hear a click where the gas valve opens, then a nice little rumble as the heater fires and you might smell a little gas. This is typical, it will take you know, up to 30, 30 seconds to a minute for it to call for gas and immediately fire. Once again, you're doing all this while the water is running through the pump and the system. There's the click. There's the rumble. And I can smell a little bit of gas. That's normal. The gas smell is gone. And to double check, Put your hand over the blower and you should feel heat. Say if you wanted to go to spa mode or the spa heat already preset, you would just hit over to spa and there you can see it's set at 102 and the current water temperature is 68. Like I said, it's just a setting, the spa in the pool is just a setting to control two different stored temperatures for each. It will not change the valves. Once you are done, you would hit spa and you can see now it says gas heater is off. Press pour spa for your desired temperature. It is normal if the blower stays on for, you know, a little extra 20, 30 seconds after, you, after it's been running just to cool down the system. That is your new Jandy heater tutorial.